How's it going guys? Tony from HonestGamesReviews.com with part 2 of The Witcher 3 World Hunt. Uh, if you kind of watched the last video you kind of saw me get stuck on a wolf which is kind of like my first hour or so in the game so I was kind of a low level ranking. Uh, since that video I've kind of sunk about 22 hours into the game. Uh, it's obviously improved a lot, you know, I'm a much more stronger character now. Uh, thankfully I've defeated the wolf, uh, spoiler alert on that one, but I'll try to put that in the start of the video so you kind of see what happened there. Uh, I can't see the anti-climax that it actually was once I went back when I was like a level 8. Uh, obviously when I tried to tackle him first time I was a level 1 so I was still learning things but you know I went back when I was level 8 and kind of demolished him in like 5 seconds. Uh, but yeah after that I'll do like a, another side quest so it'll still be story spoiler free so you know if you kind of want to see a bit more of the game after the first part you know you can certainly enjoy this part without any worry about any spoilers popping up. Uh, I certainly got to start typing a review for this very soon. It's kind of one of those games where you're scared to though because no matter what you type, uh, people will always say, have you finished the game? And, and there's just no way you can finish this game while also getting a review out while it's still relevant, if you know what I mean. It's uh, one of those games that you kind of can sink as many hours into it possibly as you can, which for me at the moment is a bit like I say, it's been like 22, 23 hours, uh, and kind of let your feeling, feelings known then. I mean, for me personally, it's 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 one of the best games released so far this year, uh, and that's talking from a, a non-RPG guy who kind of don't normally like these kind of games. I wasn't really a big fan of Skyrim. I kind of sunk, you know, I'd say I probably sunk about 15 hours into Skyrim, then got bored. Uh, but this certainly is not the case on this at all. Uh, you know, the graphics are fantastic, the story's well told. Uh, you feel a connection with the characters, uh, for you know, which is what you want from a game like this. Uh, that's not saying the game's perfect, however. I mean, like I said, you know, it's the combat's a bit iffy. Uh, the alchemy's not really explained that well for a novice game like myself. Uh, it could be explained a bit better. Uh, and kind of, you know, it's probably numbed down a little bit for me to enjoy more if I put it on the easy setting. Uh, rather than the guys who can kind of slam it on the harder settings who are kind of, you know, well played in the games like this and they kind of enjoy it a bit more. Uh, but for me, that could have been explained a bit better. And you know, other than that, I mean, the, the, the combat is only really the weak point for me. Uh, like I said, the graphics are fantastic, the story is great. Uh, you know, there's tons of things to do. I mean, you're certainly getting value for money anyway. Uh, you know, like I said, I picked it sort of £35, and like I said, I've already put, what, 23 hours into it so far, and there still feels like I've got tons left. Uh, and then after that, obviously, I'm going to pick up the expansion pass as well, which is like an extra £16, which is going to add another 30 hours on top. Uh, I think we've had three DLC so far. I think we've had four release so far. Uh, mostly, some of them have been like uh, you know, had hair and beards and stuff like that. Uh, but there was a contract release yesterday, uh, which I downloaded. So I might need to go and check that out. Uh, yeah, but like I said, like this, like I said, this is the part two. So what I'll do is I'll show you me killing the werewolf in the most anticlimax uh, of a boss fight ever, uh, and then we'll try and you know we'll have another little explore around and kind of do another side quest and see what happens. Uh, so if you want a part 3 on this, uh, like I said, like the last video, drop a like, uh, let me know in the comments below what you want to see. If you want to see me have a closer look at something, uh, then I will do that for you in the next video. Uh, if you're not subscribed to the channel already, please do. Like I said, drop a like if you want to see more Witcher. And just thanks for watching, and I'll speak to you soon. Bye. We need to talk. It's Nalen! Lycanthropy can afflict anyone, but it is a curse, so sorry, but I have to. You don't understand! I love him! He was near to being mine till you came along! Go away! Leave us be! Not till I find out what's going on here. I love him. Always have. Even after I'd learned his secret. You... You knew? Did you know I shot myself in here to wait out me change? I knew, and I didn't mind. But you chose Hannah. I wanted her to see you. I wanted her to fear you. She'd not have stayed. And we could be together. You... Brought her here. That night. It was the reason I had the taste of blood in me mouth come morn. I did it for us. 
She was to see you turn, not more. I didn't want her death. You've got to believe me. I don't. And I'll kill you willingly. First time for that, in fact. You won't kill anyone ever again. No! Don't hurt him! Get out of here before I change my mind. Run. Frights and horrors, imps, Samovilla's Huh? What do you want? Hear about the notice. Got monster trouble? Trouble? <laughs> Good one. We're not having trouble. We're up shit fucking creek. Some shaggy fuck knows what sitting in the woods attacking every plow and transport that dares take the high road. When he out to bolts, arrows, rations, all around. Fucked. Sent a patrol out. Lokes never came back. So the job's simple. Bring me the fucker's head, and I'll give you gold. As much as the notice says, I'm not gonna haggle. Quartermaster won't budge. But I can throw in a pass that'll get you across the Pontar. So, deal? Sounds fair. See what I can do. You're that white one. I advise you well. Steer far afield of Spitfire Bluff. Or.
What now, you piece of hell? Come on now. right at the skin. Footprints. A survivor? Either that or the monster's a humanoid. Looted bear. Either someone stole the cargo after the monster attack, or our monster collects military paraphernalia. Something's fishy here. I should follow these tracks. One step more, and you'll gain a new hole in your head, Dwan. What do you seek here? Speak! Set your weapon aside. You've killed enough humans already. No. No, I have not. At least one more must die. Etna!
idea these tariffs. Twelve passes at two minutes. You're back, finally. Did you get the beast? No beast to speak of in the woods. Just elves from the square tail band that attacked the convoys. Here, they're squirrel tails. Squirrel tail, you say? Hmm. And I thought we'd exterminated the last of those vermin. And the non-humans left had wised up. Well, seems we'll need to pacify them again. Make a list of all the long ears around, and hang every tenth one. That should do it. Yeah, definitely. I see you would have a mind on this. You're a good man. Here, the gold I promised you, and the pass. Good luck.